Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. If you have voided the previous episode because you just couldn't take the moral and or ethical dilemmas, we could be in an even bigger dilemma going in here. Because I don't know what's in here, and I can't imagine it's going to be very nice. Oh god. Right. What was that? Why is everybody dead? Why is nobody carrying anything worth looking at? No! Ah! Those bodies don't half fly when you mine them. I might just have a sit down for a second. Oh. Hello, welcome to my hotel. How can I help? Yes, I would like some food. Thank you. I'll have some crisps. And uh, these gumdrops. Terrible diet. Just dreadful. First aid box at all? First aid box. No. Really, really, really hoping. For a first aid box? No. Oh, that's the cleanest toilet in the whole of Fallout there. Well, that was worth coming for on its own. No, seriously, what was that? <laughs> Where did that come from? Yeah, I hear you. Come on, then. Oh, it's not seen me! Oh, I've never seen anybody take such delight in blowing a dog's head off. Oh, right. Good. Lockpicking time, then. Let's get that lockpick up. There we go. Right, now. What else do I want? Repair is obviously always very helpful. Science would allow me to do things with terminals. Survival is just survival. Medicine is very much medicine, but guns. I'm quite good with guns, I have to say. Medicine. I know my limits. Right. Comprehension. Educated. Two more skill points every time you advance in level. I think that's good. I think I'll have that. Okay. First aid box? No, but it has got one of those. First aid box? No. First aid box? No. Not another one. Where is it? They have the power. These dogs have the power of sneak. I wouldn't get too close. Oh. Dog ballet there. Do I want your hide and your meat? Not really. Is that already dead? Yes. Okay. This is very, very, very creepy. None of them ever have anything. Have they been stripped of their stuff? I don't know. That's weird. I can't select that desk. That's strange. Okay. We'll go upstairs then. In the Elder Scrolls games, it's always a really bad thing going downstairs, but in these ones, it's always a really bad thing going upstairs. I'm not stupid.
No. Oh. Damn you. Oh, no, there's another one as well. Why, you no learn? I've shot all your friends. Ah! Ooh, it's running off. I don't think so. Sorry, that was that was awful. <laughs> there is now a thunderstorm going on outside. If anybody watched the uh, the last episode, oh, don't know if you can hear that. That's a lot of thunder. Whoa! And just like that, I got straight back up again. How brilliant am I? Never play games like this in the middle of a thunderstorm. It's not good for you. Where's that purified water? I shall be having some of that. I'm still not very alive. Even after all that, I'm still not very alive. Okay. Um, I don't really want to drink any dirty water, do I? I'll have a steak. And some barrel cactus fruit. And, um... Oh, some... Whoops! Oh dear, I didn't mean to read that. And some more Nuka-Cola. There we go. This can't be it. This can't be... That, that can't be it, though. That can't be it. No, oh, there's another upstairs. Ah! Now that's more like it. Now we're talking. This is presumably where the lottery took place. That's very unpleasant. Can I repair any of this? Surely my gun's had it. No. Oh, hello. Yes, that's roughly what just happened outside, funnily enough. Yeah, just like that. Except it made a more of a rumbling noise. Oh, food. Great. I need some rad away. If I keep eating all this food, I'm going to end up very sick. In the meantime, I'm going to keep eating all this food. Mmm, up fruit. It's been a while. What else have I got? Steak. Squirrel. On sticks and in stews. That's better. Yay. There's not a great deal else around though, is there? Why am I here? Why am I bothering? What horror is about to unfold? It's just too quiet. I find it very difficult to believe that this place is completely abandoned. Nope. What am I missing? more useful. Oh, I don't want a lottery ticket. <laughs> don't know, all sorts of problems there. This is getting a bit more interesting now. Prison break high roller. High roller? No idea what any of that means. Okay. Out of any of those books I picked up, are any of them permanent? Big Book of Science is permanent. Weapons Today isn't. Locksmith's Reader isn't. Programmer's Digest isn't. Pity. Grilled Mantis. Let's be eating that. Right, unfortunately, I still can't move. Right, something's going to have to go then. Hatchet. As much as I love the fact you have bonus limb damage, you're going to have to go. 
Everything else, though, is potentially jolly useful. I like my incinerator. That's not going anywhere, before you ask. Um, that can go. I think that's going to have to go. Although, if I drop that... Ooh! I nearly dropped a hatchet on my foot. That could have been really unpleasant. I don't need to find extra ways of killing myself. Okay, right. Well, this has all been very peculiar, because I really genuinely expected some major carnage, actually. But there has been nothing, except for a rem... Whoa! <laughs> okay, there may be no carnage in the game, but there is some carnage outside. That is pretty loud. I don't know if you can hear that. My microphone sometimes picks up things and sometimes doesn't. That is a lot of thunder. Yikes. It's actually making this game all the more creepy because all I can hear is thunder and lightning going on outside. And all the other weird things that accompany it. Have you ever noticed that? Like hearing water dripping in places you've never noticed before and wondering whether your gutters are overflowing. Or little sort of scratchy metal sounds and you think, what's that? Which is just as well, because there's absolutely nothing happening around here at all, is there? Right. I think I need to get out of here before my morals and or ethics kick back in. Just before I do, though. Did I go in this one? Did that just say Nipton Hotel? Oh my goodness. Expensive stuff. And I don't have... Anything I can carry it with. Right, okay. This is, um, interesting. Nothing in here? Oh, thank you, lockpicking. Oh... phone will ring in a minute and it'll be the dealer and I'll say no deal no deal whatsoever that can't be the whole hotel is that just the ooh, jalapenos is that just the front of the hotel or did I read it wrongly because that's entirely possible no it definitely said hotel, how strange right, no this is just getting increasingly creepy and I would quite like to leave Let's do that. Where am I actually heading? Oh, I'm only heading just across the road, so I'm going to go back up here. And I'm going to sell things. And then I'm going to carry on on my journey. And we're going to forget that either of the last two episodes ever happened, if that's okay with you. Because it's more than okay with me. Let's see how he wants to greet me this time, shall we? What are you doing today? You're, um, putting maize in a freezer. Good! Good, at least you, you're doing your job. Hey there. You looking to buy some supplies? No, I'm looking to offload some crap. Can do. So much stuff. I don't even know what I need or what I want anymore. You can have my beer. And you can have those, because I don't think I use them. You can have all the cigarettes. That, oh yes. I can have the flower. Goodness knows what that's for. You're not having my jalapenos, though. No. Uh, you can definitely have the lottery ticket. They're worth ten thingies! Why did I not pick them all up? Oh, damn it! Why did I not pick up all the. Oh. I'm not going back. <laughs> there will be no going back for lottery tickets. Rebound. Scratch, can have that. I never use stealth boys, do I? For the time being, you can have that. Turbo plus one. Hmm. There we 
go, all of the above. And then if you've got any rad away of any description. Oh, you've got a mine. That's an interesting thought. But have you got any rad away first? Oh, he hasn't. Where would I get that? Oh, there's a, there's a doctor, isn't there? There's a doctor. The doctor might be able to sell me some rad away. Yep. Yes, Pleasure you might. Pleasure business with you. Take it easy now. Oh! Oh! Mm. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, everything in this game is starting to creep me out. It's because it's thundering. There's something very, very creepy about thunder. Especially in the daytime. Right. I think he was up here. Because this view... Looks jolly familiar. <laughs> Does it not? Dr. Mitchell, I'm really sorry I ripped off all your stuff. I'm really, really sorry. But, um, but I did. How are you holding up? Surprisingly well. Sure. Okay, good. Rad away. No, not rad. Oh, no. He's not got any. How can you not have any? Oh, good grief. He's not got any. Well, that's just incredibly irritating. I've got two submachine guns. They're worth a fortune. How many not be two? Can you... Oh, can you hear my radiation? Sure, I can help you out. How much do you want? Oh! Well, come back when you do. I'll be here. Do you want a gun? Let me just check. Oh, you can put that... Oh, he's eating squirrel bits. Wow. Truly, sir, you're one of us. Let me just see whether I can repair this submachine gun. Can. So how much is my new one worth? Loads. How are you holding up? Much better now that I know I've got something worth four figures. Sure. Oh, but he's hardly got any caps, has he? Right, I only need 40 caps. Do you want... I never use that. Do you want that? You can have that. Yeah, do you want that? I'm never going to use all these. I'm never going to use all these weapons. Never. Never. Damage 11. My 9mm one. Damage 11. Right, well in that case there's absolutely no point in having both, is there? Um, there we go. Exit. Can you heal my radiation sure, now? I... Okay. All done. Thank you all. Lovely. Right. How do I get out of here? Oh, there we go. And there's a familiar looking view. But I feel a bit better now because I know what I'm doing. Sort of. Gameplay Jenny!